everyone, TJ Horse Girl bringing you another video of um, terrifying footage of people being followed home. Um, this ought to be interesting. So I always get not paranoid, but every now and again I look around to make sure I'm not being followed, which I haven't been, thank goodness. But so let's just see what happens with this. Have you ever had the feeling that you were being followed? Yep. It's terrifying, right? The only thing worse than feeling like you're being followed is actually being followed. Your home is supposed to be a sanctuary and a safe place. When people violate your safe place by following you home or even attempting to break in, it can leave your home feeling unsafe. Today, with the rise in popularity of home security cameras, people have caught disturbing footage of people following you home. Imagine going to sleep feeling totally safe, but when you wake up and check your security camera footage, danger was lurking just outside your front door. Here are 10 of the most horrifying clips of footage of people being- Makes me wonder. You know, I don't have one of those security cameras living in an apartment. It just makes me wonder how many people have lingered outside my door, and I don't even know it. Oh, let me turn on captions. Sorry. Um, how many people have lingered outside my door, and I wouldn't even know it. If they're really quiet, my dog doesn't even notice, but if they make any kind of noise, she barks. So if they even tried to get in, she would know. ...followed to their homes. Elderly woman followed home. Ooh, elderly woman. Don't mess with the elderly people. Just in Come April of this year, Claudette Jones, an 84-year-old woman, was robbed at gunpoint in her driveway by a man who had followed her back to her house. A security camera above her garage caught the whole event on tape. After running errands, something she does every day, Claudette began to drive home. Unfortunately, she did not realize that she was being followed. As she pulls into her driveway, an unknown car pulls up and stops in the middle of the street in front of Claudette's home. Now see, she can't drive away. They've got her blocked in unless they, she rams into their car or cuts across her lawn. <coughs> I actually had someone do this to me one time. I was dropping off a friend's child when I used to babysit for them um, years ago. This child's grown and married with kids of his own now. Just as old I am now. Anyway, um, but they weren't trying to hurt me. I'd had a dent in the side of my car and they offered to fix it and they had blocked me in the driveway so I couldn't back out. Before Claudette can even open the door of her car to get out, a strange man gets out of the unknown car in the street and approaches her car. He opens Claudette's door and points a gun right at her face. He yells, give me your wallet. Luckily, Claudette willingly gave her wallet to him without any resistance, which may have saved her life. After he takes her wallet, he runs back to his car and speeds off. Though traumatized, Claudette escaped unharmed. <laughs> Young man followed home by clown. Uh. Oh. In 2018, the YouTuber Infinite was followed home by a scary clown on Halloween. That is the creepiest thing ever. Oh my god. He was able to capture a video of it from inside his house. In the video, you can clearly see a scary clown standing outside the window of Infinite's house. When the clown sees Infinite filming, he waves and then disappears around the side of the home. Is he going to the door? No, 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 I have to lock it. This is when Infinite gets really scared as he realizes that his front door is unlocked and that the clown may be able to- Always lock your door the second you come home, people. ...get inside his house. He makes it to his front door and locks it just in time. He puts the camera up to the peephole, and you can see the clown standing outside his door trying to get in. Scary. What makes the video even more disturbing is that while Infinite is running around his house locking the doors and windows, a red balloon can be seen in one of the rooms. Oh, I'm calling the cops. I have to call the cops. This on Halloween. Infinite claims that he didn't see the red balloon until after he rewatched his videos. <laughs> Little girl is followed home by an... Now how do you get a red balloon in your house when you don't even know it? How do you not see? I mean, I know he's focused on getting. I actually wonder how much of that staged. I'm not saying it was. It may not have been. It might have been real, but YouTube people tend to do stuff for clicks and views. They tend to stage, stage stuff. I'm not accusing this guy of anything. It might be a totally real scenario, but the fact that there's a balloon in the house tells me there's a possibility he might have staged some of that. Unknown vehicle. In 2019, a young girl was followed for several blocks by a man in his car as she was walking home from school. This is literally every parent's worst nightmare. Fortunately, the little girl was smart and was able to get away. The incident was captured on a neighbor's outdoor security camera. The young girl was aware of the car following her, so when she walked past a big truck parked on the street, she hid behind it. Good job. 
The man in the vehicle waited for her to come out from behind the truck for a couple of minutes, and then he pulled away. The little girl stayed hidden behind the trucks, which was a good decision because the man turned around and tried to look for her again. He even tried to ask her a question about school, but she stayed quiet and stayed hidden. The man eventually gave up and drove off, and the girl sprinted the rest of the way home. Had she not been aware of her surroundings, there's no telling what could have happened to her. Couple followed by an unknown vehicle for over an hour. Brittany Morrow, a family vlogger, posted a video to her YouTube channel in 2019, describing an incident that had happened to her and her husband. While they had been driving around town, they realized that a vehicle seemed to be following them. This guy has been following us for an hour. At first they weren't sure and thought that they were just being paranoid, until her husband took a few turns and the vehicle continued to stay close to their tail. Hurry babe, because he's turning around too. This is when Brittany got out her camera to start filming the car while her husband called the police. The police told Brittany and her husband to stay on the phone and keep driving until they could get a police car out to intercept the vehicle. In the video, you can see how frightened Brittany is because her children are also in the car with her and her husband. Finally, the police arrive, stop the vehicle, and talk to the driver. Brittany was told by police that the driver had said he was following them because he would saw them in his neighborhood and thought that they looked suspicious. Even though Brittany and her husband weren't convinced by this explanation, there was nothing more that they could do, as the man did not attempt to harm them in any way. Husband Confronts Wife Stalker Sometimes stalker incidents can turn violent. In April of this year, Matthew Guerin confronted the driver who had followed his wife home. The driver had followed the woman in a fit of road rage. Matthew came out to confront the driver for his inappropriate behavior, but the driver did not want to hear any of it. Instead, he ran Michael over with his vehicle, dragging him almost 50 feet up the street. Then the driver sped off. The entire incident was captured on a neighbor's security camera located across the street. Luckily, Matthew survived, but he was badly injured. He was immediately rushed to the emergency room for urgent care. Man follows woman and her children home. In February of this year, Allie Porth had just arrived home with her two children. Her doorbell camera recorded her and the kids going inside, closing the door, and immediately being followed by a mysterious man. The man knocked on the door and even tried the doorknob. Allie didn't answer. He stayed on their doorstep for a long time. Allie felt that he was wanting her to open the door so that he could push himself inside. Finally, the man leaves the doorstep, but her security camera captures him pacing outside the front of her house. Allie's husband was more than an hour away, so she called the police. By the time they arrived, however, the man had mysteriously disappeared. Allie and the children had never seen the man before. It's scary to think what may have happened had one of them answered the door. Men try to lure a kid into car with candy. A 10-year-old boy named Graydon was walking home when a car started closely following him. Two men were in the car and they asked Graydon if he wanted to get into the vehicle to have some candy. They said, get in the back seat, we have some candy. Graydon said no and continued home. The car followed him all the way there. Graydon's doorbell camera was able to capture the incident. When Graydon got home, he tried to open his front door, but it was locked. Panicked that the men may try and grab him, Graydon picked up large rocks and threatened to throw them at the vehicle. He saw that his neighbor's front door was open, so he ran inside their house and locked the door. The car waited in the neighbor's driveway for a little while before finally leaving. A couple gets followed home and attacked in their driveway. A California couple was returning from a night out in Hollywood, not realizing that they were being followed. Their home security camera outside their garage captured the entire incident. When the couple pulls into their driveway, another car immediately pulls up behind them. A group of men gets out of the car and pulls the couple out of their vehicle. They use tasers and stun guns to take control of the couple and hold them at gunpoint as they rob their vehicle and their home. When they were finished, they left the couple in their driveway and sped off with all of their belongings. Before we play the last clip, you've watched this far, so why not consider subscribing to our channel? I post two new scary videos every week, so subscribe to make sure you stay up to date with the new releases. Family Attacks Sexual Predator a father found out that a man had been sending lewd messages to his 15-year-old daughter on Facebook. When he found the messages saying that the man was going to come to his house to see his daughter, the father decided to set up a trap. He set up an outdoor security camera to capture the whole setup. The father set up a tent and messaged the predator as his daughter, saying that she would be waiting in the tent for him. 
When the predator came to their house and tried to get into the tent, the father and his brothers tackled the predator, tied his hands and feet together, and called the police. The predator was a full-grown man and knew that the girl he was seeing was 15. The father did what he felt was best to protect her. Important to teach your children how to use social media. Because you never know the person on the other end may or may not be telling the truth on who they are. They could claim to be a 10-year-old boy or a 10-year-old girl and turn out to be a 50-year-old man wanting to be a predator. There we go. There's my alarm system. That was my alarm system growling. That's my girl. You tell them. You tell them. Anyway, be safe out there, people. TJ Horskull, riding out.